please be sure to seek medical advice before you use meha eh, we do mehali design using any form of hina trust me Welcome back to my channel. This is Mira Sinisa back again with another video on good hair and design. Before I move on to today's video, I'd like to say a very big thank you for the subscription, the likes, and comments on my previous video. Thank you so much. And today's video is going to be about um what my hand design is and some types I have readily available just to show you how it is and how um, you go about it. Yeah. So before we move on, if you see this video to be worth sharing, please like, comment, share and subscribe as well. And let me know what you think about it. Really. Thank you very much. Now today's video is about some types of uh, mehandi or mehandi design or hina used for design. Yeah. So when we talk about hina mehandi design, it's basically talking about designing the body, artistic decoration of the body or any other thing using hina. Hina in our local language is called lettuce. But it's a more, uh, should I say, it's a more finer, yeah, finer version of the lending we have. It's, about, it's like the particle size of the lending is more coarser or feels grittier than the Hina itself. So reducing the particle size of Hina to so about half of this initial size gives us the Hina we have with additional fragrance and, and other things added to it. Yeah. So basically that's just what Hina is. And it mostly comes in the form of paste, powder, and um, uh, sometimes like dye with other essential oils in it in them. Now in Ghana we have different types of Hina. Some of which uh, don't need okay. We have hair dyes that are used for body decoration and we have actual Hina that are used for decoration. Now you need to be very careful. If you hire a Mehandi designer or you buy Mehandi and you want to use it, you look at the content, what it's made of. Look, try testing your skin first. If you are allergic to um, Hina and all those dyes, because it can, it can cause a really huge damage to the skin when you are really allergic to it and when the content used is of harsh condition. Now, I haven't gone into details to know what the content is. I'm, I am I've only focused on what the Hina design, I mean, what the Hina powder is. And I got to know it was just our local name that we used. That, that has been uh, combined with other fragrance to make it so you know, uh, sweet uh, scented, but nice scented. Yeah. So you need to be very careful to look at all these things before you purchase and you know, or before you even apply it on your body. Now I have some uh, Hina, Hina <laughs> examples here of which I want to show you. I don't have everything but in Ghana here what we have that is what I want to show you and just be careful with some fake ones. We have some uh, Ghanaian dyes that are mixed by some the handy designers for design of the body and it ends up causing harsh uh, skin conditions which is no good. So um, I have the wild camphor wild olive sculpture. Now most of the ones I have, my mom is actually uh, into these products, some of these products. Most of the ones I have here is what is imported from uh, Saudi and uh, Mali and other countries. Yeah, there's countries where the hand design is very common. Yeah, so recently we have this from Camphor Wild Olive Culture uh, for permanent powder hair color, right? And for hair design as well, you can see. You can see the design there, yeah. So it can it, it has been made in such a way that it can be used for the hair as well as uh, 
you guys and i've tried it before and it was it was okay i'll i'll, I'll make sure to make a video <laughs> on the design of this and look at the reaction yeah, yeah so yes and yes as they've written here they've written the ingredients as well as the caution that this preparation may cause skin irritation and inflammation any person seeking uh, to use it should first obtain the advice of an expert so most of the times when you buy this product they let you know what it is how um the, con the constituents of the product to let you know or have a fair idea if it's not going to be good for you so before you use any other products confide in uh, a good expect of Hina, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. A very good Hina and designer. Now, you don't need, there are others that you need to uh, mix hydrogen peroxide with, but with this, you don't need that. I don't, I, it's quite unfortunate I don't have that. But with this, you don't need that. The only thing you need is just water. Warm water. I, I recommend warm water. <laughs> Sometimes the particles are very greasy and you need to mix them into so, like a final, you know, so let's see how it's right. Okay, yeah. so it comes with a container for measuring the powder in the water as well, and this is how it looks like. It has a globe inside as well, yeah. So it is mostly filled to the brim, and you can measure any amount you want. Uh, the number of individuals going to use it. So yes, this has been tried and tested. So if you see this, and I'm sure it's, it's affordable, yeah. So if you see this, you, know, you can actually buy this and purchase it. The henna uh, There are some that also come in the form of uh, a paste that is already being made, which comes in the form of, of a paste in a tube. They are either black or dark brown or reddish, yeah. And this is actually is made from Hina itself. The, the uh, correct Hina, I'm talking about correct Hina. It's made from, and they have different brands. This is just um, a, a one type of brand. Um, which is, hmm. Okay, it's an Arabic though. Asham Skun, yeah. Asham Skun, uh, uh, yeah, Asham Skun. Okay, who means Asham? Yeah, Kun Hina Face, yes. I got it right. <laughs> yeah. So, this is how it looks like. And sometimes some come in a fake form, and you need to be aware. Those that come in a fake form are very watery and feel like dye, like a mixture of dye, but this is not actually like that. So this is how it looks like. It's very difficult to come out. Hope you can see. And this is how it looks like. Yeah. So there are several bar. This is red. Yeah, it's red. There are several varieties, different different products which come in this form. Just need to look out for what fake and what original. And there are some that also come with the comb itself. Like, you'd be very fortunate to actually buy <laughs> an, a, a Hina which is already in the comb. Like, it's just so simple. You don't need to, to buy um, a cone or make it a cone to, do, to use it or make your own thing, but it's already made yet for you. So, this is an example. As an example, and this is from India, came like a month ago. One of my friends, my dear friend, shout out to you, who came from India recently. And mm, so, I'm thinking of me, she bought this for me. Yeah, so I tried uh, using it, and I had a very good experience with it. So simple to use very nice scented and it i recommend this to anybody who wants to do the handy design in ghana here yeah. so what you need to do is just 
cut the tip just a little bit and just use it. And some of these are actually original. Yeah, those have come across. We actually had this is red. I mean dark brown, you know, it's a coffee brown color. There was actually one that uh, my mom actually bought, which we sold um, for last festive season. Trust me, it had massive patches. Like it was just marvelous. People liked it, and it was black, very thick, and it was very good for. And yeah, I actually it didn't waste my time. It was I was I was I was able to just decorate very well and it was smooth as well so i didn't need to hustle getting water the henna powder to make add it to a rubber and those of us um, who know how to use the powder now the powdery form of uh, the henna mostly requires um, a cone now if you don't have a cone you can actually mix it in a con small container all right the powder and the water in a small container and pour it in the pure saraba uh, should I say ice water? <laughs> uh, the ice water. Let me see the former ice water we have. We sold on the market. And mix it with it. So you mix it and then uh, tie it along one of the edges of the ice water. <sighs> ice water rubber. Yeah. So that's just, I think, if my memory serves me right then, if my, from my research, mainly the types of Hina, uh, Found in Ghana are uh, this one which comes in the form of a paste, that, that which comes in the form of a powder, and that which comes uh, already made in a cone like this. And there's actually one which that, uh, comes as a powder in the sachet itself. These are just some um, that are really available to me. I'll make sure to get the others and I'll show it in my next uh, video that I'll do. Yeah, so basically, this is uh, what. Yeah, some types of handy design that you can, I recommend that you use, but please be sure to seek medical advice before you use Meha, uh, we do Mehandi design using any form of human. Trust me, there are in several situations, several cases where people go for these designs, very, very beautiful designs, but end up getting sores all over their body, like their hands. Imagine your your brightest day, your wedding day, only one festive season, you try to do it and the following morning you wake up and you have rashes all over, you have to be rushed to the hospital. Please let's be careful with the type of inner designs we do and uh, if any designer brands already makes inner to you to design your body, please make sure to ask where it's from. It's really, really important because you can damage your skin and I don't think Ladies like us who want to damage you know, our first thing. So please be careful. Yeah, so, if you who like this video, please like, comment, and share as well. Like your comments mean a lot to me. I I need your comments to be able to know how to go about my next video and just comment please. <laughs> like and share and um, subscribe if you find this channel interesting and I know my my screen is not really clear but for now I'm using a laptop I need a laptop for my videos and my camera lap, my, uh, my laptop camera so I'll be working on getting a new one on getting on making a new one which will be uh, I wish will be very very soon thank you so much thank you very much if I also like my Facebook page at uh, MI Mihandi Design and follow my Instagram page where you can actually see some of my designs. Uh, Mira the Easter 30. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Bye.